What's up, my dears? This is Shuri from Shuri Dealing for All Things Relaxing. Just checking up on you. I hope that you are doing well, and I hope someone's loving all over you. Today, we're going to talk about yellow cotton. Right here, growing in America. <laughs> it comes in three colors, plants. Yellow, we spoke about before. White, we spoke about before. But it also can grow in pink. So it comes in three different color flowers. You can grow this here in California, Virginia. You also can grow it in Florida because it's different um, regions you can grow it in. The 9 and 11 region, which is in Florida, and it has different names for them. I cannot pronounce them, but I will be leaving that information at the bottom in the description below if you want to know exactly what particular yellow cotton flower grows in particular areas. You also can grow these in your home with the right soil, which it have to be a sand-based soil so it can have moisture, so the plant can grow and it can breathe and it won't get rotten. And remember I told you about the drip method. You can buy yourself the thing that you put inside your plant and it can drip the amount of water that the plant needs to be fed. And they also have food that you can feed the plant with as well. Make sure that the soil is rich and in fiber and you can grow this plant in your house. Now, if you're a person that got a little bit of land, and you want to grow this plant you can also get yourself a greenhouse you can go to amazon and you got to make sure that this greenhouse is between 75 to almost 80 degrees because that's how they grow they have to, it has to be warm and they have to keep the soil has to be moist you have to be very particular with this plant because it's very delicate in order for you to get the bloom that you're looking for not just the flower bloom but to see how much cotton you can get out of there now you also don't have to dye this cotton also. You can't have to dye this cotton. So if you got a yellow garment, you just, like I said, with the brown, all you got to do is let it soak it in for a little bit, and it's going to absorb it. So this is kind of cool. So we have, we talked about the natural white cotton. We talked about the brown cotton. And now today we're talking about yellow cotton. So if you're interested in finding more information, most of the stuff will be linked below. And I'm going to leave a picture after we speak about this. So... Go get you a pot and start potting some cotton. So y'all take care. God bless you all. Go to John 14, 27. Yahshua left you some of that good, good, good stuff. Seek first the kingdom of God and all his righteousness. Study your Bible. Seek wise counsel. And also have a study group. Get a pot lock going on. And start praying to the Heavenly Father. Bye, guys. Peace out.